What's up, guys? Welcome back to the Redneck TV channel. And today, we're gonna be doing a dip review over Tough Guy Orange. <laughs> Alright guys, if you're a true Redneck TV fan, you'll know there's been some changes. I brought the old handy dandy rocking chair back, back from my older videos, and also I'm wearing the Ford hat again instead of the Ripple flag hat because a lot of people, I don't have no idea how, but they were saying, oh well man, you've changed man, and you, you act different, so I'm gonna, I kind of studied some of my older videos, I see no change at all in my personality, but I guess I'm gonna try to be like I did in my older videos because... Some people seem to enjoy that better. But today, we're gonna be reviewing some, uh, take my retainer out, Tough Guy Orange. Here's a presentation of the can. I mean, it's real sexy. It's orange, says Tough Guy, just like all of them do. Metal lid, plastic back, you know, you know how they look. Well, without further ado, let's just go ahead and hop right into this video, and we're gonna go ahead and crack the seal. Uh, yeah, it's just this feeling you get when you crack a can, man. You, you just don't wanna understand it. You gotta try it for yourself. If you've never cracked a can, you gotta... Uh, <laughs> that's the shit. But we're gonna go ahead and pack us a dip of this, so if you're at home and you ain't got one in, pack one with me, y'all. Yeast, yeast, uh, uh, <laughs> yeast infection. Oh, yeah, down goes the lid. Oh, yes. God, it smells just like oranges. You wouldn't fucking believe it. It smells like oranges. <gasps> if you got an orange, held it up to your face. That's exactly what tough guy smells like. Ah! Uh, Fuck! Got a little bit of that shit in my nose. But none of y'all know this, my favorite artificial flavor, like out of candies and shit that I like to eat, my favorite flavor is orange. My fruit flavor. I just love orange. I don't know what it is about it, but I just love it. But as you can tell, I'm probably gonna like this shit a lot. We're gonna go ahead and get us a pinch of this shit. Oh, let me show y'all the cut of this. This is what the texture of Tough Guy looks like if you didn't know. I know I'm not really clear about it in my other reviews, but I just wanted to show y'all de in detail. It's really stringy. It's just like chew. It's a really nice cut in the lip, so yeah. I spilt some. But let's go ahead and get us a lipper of it, y'all. Tap your screen with me, a little dip bump for you. Mm. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. If you wanna try some of this shit yourself, you can go to toughguychew.com. Get yourself some cans of it. Huh. Fuck! Damn it! I spilt my all my fucking can on the floor! Shit! Hot diggity damn! Look at all the fucking hair in my dick! Damn nasty ass shit. Fucker. Damn. Mm. Oh, fuck. But today we're gonna be spitting in the Chris Dips one tits money mud jug. Sexy as hell. Uh. So if you wanna get you one of these badass spit tunes or any other mud jug on mudjug.com, feel free to use my promo code RNTV15 for 15% off your whole entire mud jug order. They don't spill! Ha! Let me go ahead and show y'all the spit of this tough guy orange. Mm. Really black spit, all tough guy. Yeah, it's really black spit. Really, just as soon as I put this in, I can already taste the wonderful orange flavor. I just want to eat it, honestly. But while we're letting this soak, I'm going to talk about, uh, if you did not know, just a few, like, three or four days ago, my sub count, it was at 44,000, and then just out of seconds, boom, went straight up to 63,000. So I looked at my Social Blade account, and it said I gained 20,000 subscribers in just one hour. I was like, what the fuck? So on my fan account on Snapchat, I was freaking out. I was like, oh my god, I gained 20,000 subscribers! I was real excited about it. I was like, holy shit, man. I have 63,000 subs. That's so many. And also, I was kind of mad because, you know, as I said, I'm going to eat a full can of dip for 50,000 subscribers, so... Yeah, I was pretty mad because I was like, wow, I didn't even get to... <laughs> Fuck. I had the 63,000 subscribers for about two days and just out of nowhere went away. What pisses me off is they actually took away the subscribers that I gained from those two days. So I gained like 400 subs for those two days that I had them and they took those away as well. I was like, well, fuck you. And there's been a lot of accusing. Oh, Redneck TV, he just bought 20,000 subs and then YouTube took them away. That's what, what happened. No, I did not buy subs and nor do I buy my subs. That's a big thing around here. And no, I don't buy my views either. Why, why the fuck would I do that? I didn't even know you could buy subscribers. And even if I did buy subscribers, I wouldn't get any views from those subs because they'd be ghost accounts. So it's pretty fucking pointless. So yeah, now that I got that cleared out of the way, I'm back to 45,000 subscribers. So yeah, 
5,000 more subs and I'll eat a full can of dip. Never really thought this day would come. That's why I basically said like at 30K, I was like, I'll just eat a full can of dip for 50K. And then people took it serious and I was like, I ain't never gonna hit 50K, so I might as well just go with it. But yeah, shit happened. My channel went <laughs> And then yeah, I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna eat a full fucking can of dip probably next month. But also while we're letting this smokeless tobacco settle and moisturize in our mouth, I want to talk about something for my personal life. Now there's been a bunch of hocus pocus bullfuck going around my school. People have been telling me that the new principal in my school is going to try to shut my channel down. And when I heard this, I was like, what the fuck? Yeah, we got a new principal this year. I don't have a problem with him. He's a pretty cool dude. Everybody else doesn't really like him that much. They miss our old principal, but... You know, I, I ain't got a problem with him. But there's just been a bunch of hocus, hocus, bullfuck saying he's gonna fucking delete my channel. I don't really know how he plans to do that. I don't know if he's just gonna wobble wobble his fucking ass through my front door and sign into my computer and delete my channel. Or if he plans to actually contact YouTube and bullshit, but... Uh... What the fuck? This is my out of school life and they have nothing to do with it. They can't tell me I have to delete my channel. It doesn't have anything to do with school, so yeah, you can't do shit. Sorry about it. Now if you want to walk through my front door and try to sign into my computer and delete my channel, go ahead and try that. I'd, li I'd like to see that happen. <clears throat> so if you're an educational board member or my principal or any other teacher watching my video and you think that I should be shut down because I still go to school and I have a YouTube channel based on smokeless tobacco and doing other shit that's really not school appropriate, fuck you! You can't make me delete my channel. I will not. I will drop out of high school before I delete my channel and that's just stone cold truth. I will drop out of high school if they say uh, either you delete your channel or you can't go to school here anymore. I just say, alright, pack me a fucking dip, walk out the damn front door drive home. Parents ask why I'm not at school. I just tell them and be like, yeah, fuck them. So that's the end of that. All right, we've had this dip soaking in for a little bit and damn, it's so far. fuck. Other than just a motherfucking orange. Put chew on it a little bit. Yeah, it tastes just like an orange. It, it is so great. I love oranges. I love the flavoring of orange. Mm. Mm. Really great stuff, man. This tough guy shit, it don't get stuck in your teeth. It don't float all over your mouth and it's really comparable to Stoker's and Cut, but it's a lot fatter. Honestly, I think Tough Guy Orange is probably the best dip I've ever had. No shit. Like, it's not something I could do every single day because I get burnt out on, like, crazy flavors like Southern Blend and shit like that. Just, like, sweet flavors like that, I get burnt out on them really easy, so I probably couldn't dip this shit every day. But honestly, this shit is really fucking good. Tough Guy Orange, the best dip ever? Oh! Let's go ahead and do a full motherfucking can of this shit. I'm tired of waiting. Let's do it like Jesse Ryan. Put it in your hand. Mmm. Ah! Oh, that's tangy. That's a little citrusy for my liking. Oh, there's hair in it. Oh, fuck. <coughs> Spit black or step back, y'all. Even a full can of this shit, it is fucking amazing. Honestly, I'm not even gonna throw this out. I'm just gonna go about my day like this. I gotta pick my girlfriend up from cheer. I'm just gonna pick her up just like this. <laughs> hey, baby. Mm! I just wanna eat it. Let's swallow a little bit of juice. Oh, that burns your throat. Honestly, now that I have have a full can of it in, I can taste the salt. There's a lot of salt in this dip. I can definitely taste it. It tastes like a salty orange. That is what Tough Guy Orange tastes like. A salty motherfucking orange. So yeah, overall rating of Tough Guy Orange. I hate to be a suck up to Tough Guy like a little pussy bitch, but I'm... I gotta give it a 10 out of 10. I've never given a 10 out of 10 review over a dip before, but this shit... Fuck. Damn, it's good. That legit landed in my fucking trash can. That's badass. But I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna set that to the side for now, just so I can talk clearly. But yeah, y'all, tough guy orange, really good shit. I'd really recommend it. Go get you a can. And if you like this video, make sure you give me a big thumbs up. Let's try to hit a thousand likes on this video. I'd really appreciate it. Also, share the video. Put it on your Snapchat, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. I don't give a fuck. Any social media or sites like that. Put it on there. And also, if you haven't already, hit the fucking subscribe button, man. I mean, come on. You just watched my entire video all the way until now, and your lazy ass won't even scroll down or flick down and tap the fucking subscribe button? I mean, what the fuck? Do it! Fucker! And also, right beside the subscribe button, there's this little bell. Why don't you go ahead and uh, place your finger and or mouse right over that bell beside the subscribe button and just uh, tap that motherfucker. Make it ring! That way, every time I upload, you get a notification when I upload, and then we'll all be happy. And also, follow me on Instagram, redneck.tv. I got funny, hilarious memes over there, funny shit, exclusive redneck TV content. So make sure you go check out that. And remember, always keep on dipping and keep on spit.
Later, bro.